We will also learn some warm-up exercises for the voice depending on your own pitch or your own foundation note. And then there will be more exercises which will open up your voice in a very different way. We will not go too much in the detail and the depth of the ragas because raga music is really like an ocean. And as we have learned when we are learning Indian music, it is an endless ocean. There is practically no depth to it. There is a beginning but no end, as we say. So we will learn just the basics of these ragas and then we will learn to start singing a mantra, for example, with the basis of those notes that we have learned. And then, slowly, slowly, I will show you the, the fine, you know, the subtle things of those Indian singing. To sing the mantra in its right pronunciation and in its right grace and in its right energy because mantra is a, a call a call to the divine so you are addressing the divine you are calling the divine and if you are not making this call in its right way which I emphasize on the pronunciation then you are not going to get the attention of that divinity so the address has to be done in a correct form and also with correct grace and the necessary devotion which I think and I feel that it comes through the depth of with the harmonium class we are going to first learn the basic exercise for your fingering depending on uh, from which note we will start so let's say if we start from a C sharp then it will be something like and 
going ahead with different exercises which make your plane, your movement of fingers more and more fluent and especially from different keys so that if you are in a situation where you have to play in different keys then you will be able to play smoothly. Second thing what we will learn is maybe certain mantras or certain kirtans and uh, we will start first understanding the basic chords of it, the song so that initially it will be easier for you to sing along that mantra. For example, And then after this, we will learn the actual melody of this mantra or this song in a melodical way so that you can also learn and go in the depth of the melody also. And what we will also emphasize is that everybody has their own foundation note of singing. So what I am going to teach you is those particular songs on a one-to-one -one level which is specially for you because your everybody has a different bass note, bass key, bass foundation sa. So based on that we will learn those chords and those melodies for those songs and that, that can be different for everybody. So that's why one-to-one -one interaction is important and in that way it will be much easier for you and will be much better for you that you learn every different mantra or a song or a kirtan in your own uh, comfortable area.